We have football season covered with these sweet pumpkin hand pies, so huddle up and let's make this touchdown dessert together. On Just Add Sugar, we're bringing you some of our favorite sugary recipes that are sure to tempt and delight any sweet tooth. How could you resist a hand pie? They're the best size for snacking on when you're watching the game, plus my favorite part is you get double crust. So to start this recipe, we're using ready-made pie dough. You can find this in the refrigerator section at your grocery store. So I'm just gonna kind of roll it out. And if it needs it, roll it a little bit more. And then you can find a football cookie cutter online or at a bake shop. The one that I found was just a little too tiny for what I wanted. So I just made a little oval shape, a little pointed football shape out of a piece of paper and I'm just gonna freehand it. I promise you this is not hard. You could even print out the shape of a football. So I'm just gonna keep cutting them out, staying as close to each other as possible so I can maximize this dough. Great, so now I'm just gonna take my little pieces of football dough and place them on a baking sheet. So now I'm gonna show you how to make a really simple filling. Into a bowl, you're just gonna add your pumpkin puree, brown sugar, your spices, cinnamon and nutmeg, and just a little bit of cream. It's that simple, just give it a whisk. So it's nice and combined, and then we're gonna fill our little football pies. Oh, it's like instant Thanksgiving in here. All right, so before we fill our pies, I'm just gonna make a simple little egg wash. It's just one egg, a little bit of water. So our egg wash is not just the binding agent that's gonna glue together our hand pies, but we're also gonna brush the tops of the pies to make them nice and shiny, and it's gonna help stick the cinnamon sugar mixture on top. So I'm just gonna put one tablespoon of the pumpkin puree mixture right into the center of each of these little pies. And then just brush the outsides of the pies with a little bit of this egg wash, just so that when we crimp the footballs, they have something nice to stick onto. Okay. And then put the other half of the dough right on top. And I like to press it down before you start crimping, just so that none of this filling gets out of there, because that's really the best part. And then using your fork, you're just gonna crimp around each football. And then we're just gonna use our fork and make four little pricks right into the middle of our hand pies. And for me, they kinda remind me of those little lace marks, which is kinda cool. Great. And then brush the tops of them again with the egg wash. This also makes them nice and crispy, which is good and sprinkle with cinnamon sugar. Yeah, why not? And now we're just gonna put this into the oven that's been preheating at 350 degrees for 10 to 15 minutes or until the tops are golden brown. Now that our hand pies have cooled, it's time to add our finishing touches, the little laces on our footballs. So I'm using cookie icing. You can buy this already made at the grocery store, in a little piping bag, super convenient. And I'm just going to outline our pies right before the crimping part. And then just do a line across and then three more lines. One, two, three. I love serving these because guys are so impressed. I mean, the women think it's great, but then guys are like, oh my God, it's a cute little pie that looks like a football. These are just awesome. And you can make several at a time, different flavors, but pumpkin's always a crowd pleaser. Awesome, these pies are so delicious. You can expect a blitz around them as they disappear. Thanks so much for watching, I'm Brandy. Let me know what your favorite football food is in the comment box below. And if you enjoyed this video, because I think you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Pop Sugar Food. I'll see you next time, bye.